Looks like we've been blessed with a rare kind of reunion, pet. Care to guess how? Can I ever? That's Banjo and Kazooie, the dynamic duo from the 64-bit era. <laughs> well, I'll be. About time those self-aware underdogs got their invitation. I heard that DK and Diddy went bananas when they saw them appear. <laughs> no surprise there. Banjo and Kazooie did have a close connection with Donkey Kong's universe, after all. So close, in fact, that even before he met Kazooie, Banjo used to race against Diddy with cars, planes, and hovercrafts. Huh. I guess building vehicles for themselves years later wasn't that far-fetched of an idea then. Still, they've been doing so for over a decade. I'm surprised their old moves haven't grown stale by this point. No, let's not judge a puzzle by its pieces, Veridi. While it has been quite a while since their quirky adventures thwarting Gruntilda's evil schemes, Banjo and Kazooie's old moves are still as avant-garde today as they were back then. By sacrificing a gold feather, for example, the duo can unleash an invincible Wonderwing dash to plow through almost any obstacle. When that happens, Pit, either dodge quickly or shield against it to avoid getting walloped. Good grief! Invincibility! Wish my wings could do something like that. In any case, though, I think now is a good opportunity for us to say... Welcome, Welcome home, Banjo and Kazooie! And Kazooie. Don't touch that dial, my lovelies. The show's not over yet. Against all odds, they've at last come to smash. The bear and bird's return makes a big splash. <laughs> Sounds like someone is channeling their inner wicked witch for the occasion. I'll admit, pretty Palutena, Banjo and Kazooie's long-awaited invite definitely intrigues me. Their legacy and moveset gushes with quirky humor, giving them plenty of humorous ways to humiliate opponents. Let me guess, Hades. One of those ways involves Banjo bludgeoning me and Pit with Kazooie, like a feathered club. Ah, the Bregal Bash. Slapstick at its finest. Seriously, Kazooie must really trust Banjo as a close friend if she's willing to let him use her as a battering weapon. Then again, it's hard to pity a mortal. Who has the gall to be caustic towards gods like us? Which is why I also can't help but leave a soft spot open for that sassy featherhead. Anyone who has the backbone to backtalk the Lord of Games himself earns my respect. No idea who that is? But I won't be so easily defeated by silly antics, Hades! You can bet on that! My bets are on the dynamic duo, actually. But by all means, Pitypat, struggle to prove me wrong. In fact, I suggest you keep an eye on Kazooie's eggs whenever she lays one. Dare I ask why, O oh Lord of the Underworld? Let's just say they give the old saying of having egg on one's face an explosive new meaning. <laughs> Greetings to all my fellow gamers out there. Thank you so much for watching this What If double feature of Palutena's Guidance and... Uh, Hades Miss Guidance. We hope you enjoyed our little presentation. And if you did, why not smash that like button and share this video around? I'm sure that our volunteer voice actors, especially mine, would greatly appreciate it. Also, if you're feeling supportive enough, consider subscribing, as well as ringing that bell icon to be notified about future content. Uh, hey, what's, uh, whoa! And be sure to let us know in the comments below which fan-made guidance you enjoyed the most. Or rather, debate on which one you thought was better. But let's be honest, everyone. It's no contest that mine was the superior version. Because it starred me, obviously. It was never a contest to begin with, Hades.
is. Now, we should give a shout out to the fine fellows at Rare and Daddy Sakurai's wonderful Smash Brothers team. For their combined efforts brought Banjo and Kazooie back into our shared multiverse in the first place. However, we were insisted by this channel's host to also give a special mention to... Oh, the Zelda Universe YouTube channel, whose influence and inspiration made this video possible. Well, since I have collaborated many times with those lovely people in the past, this shoutout gets the Lord of the Underworld's thumbs up of approval. But, since I seem to be lacking the sprite for such a particular pose, I'll just leave that to your imaginations. With all that said, I'm off to visit Spiral Mountain for a spell. Apparently, that disgustingly delightful witch, Gruntilda, has a few words of her own to express about the Smash roster too. Should be entertaining for a fellow antagonist like yours truly. TTFN, my dearest naughty fans, Hades out! Ugh, mother of me, Hades. What are we going to do with you?